Happy holidays once again, gamers. Welcome back to Time Warp. This is our second part of tonight's edition. We are doing a wrestling series, a WWE arcade style wrestling games is the series. The reason why we're doing this again is because we are getting support from the WWE in the form of Thunderdome appearances, allowing us to advertise our logo on the WWE platform. Um, earlier tonight, you tuned in and saw us do the Royal Rumble version of WrestleFest. Once again, that's an arcade game. We are using a main emulator for that. Uh, next, we're doing the other part of WrestleFest, which is the tag team tournament. Joining me now, actually, is Dreadmare, who has been returning to streaming and uh, getting his oats back, getting his uh, sea legs back, if you will, and hopefully we're going to be seeing him again very soon in Gamer's Purgatory itself. How you doing, Dread? I'm doing all right, man. How are you doing? Uh, I can't complain. Ain't nobody listening to that anyway. <laughs> uh, I'm listening, buddy. Oh, I know, buddy. Oh, I'm getting ready to go ahead and do this. Hopefully, I don't have to fuck with my controls again. Last time, I had to keep stopping the video to adjust my controls. Hopefully, that's not the case here. Doesn't look like it's going to be. Once again, you want to sit here and bulk up on your codes. Let's see if I can... Uh... Last time I was Jake Roberts, this time I think I'm going to be the Ultimate Warrior and Hulk Hogan. Anybody doesn't know, yes, originally it was WWF, but because of a lawsuit from the World Wildlife Foundation, they had to change their name to World Wrestling Entertainment, now known as WWE. This actually took place during a time where Vince McMahon and his son had acquired the rights to another rival organization known as WCW. And uh, which also gave a little bit more credence to them changing their name from World Wrestling Federation to World Wrestling Entertainment. Uh, you know, a little storyline to go along with it because lawsuit just kind of sounds pretty boring. But if they bought out the other company and changed their name, well, that's a little bit more exciting. Now, earlier I lost the Royal Rumble event, but I might do a little bit better here. Trying to get through these matches quick because I want to do a little something with Dread later. One match down. One match down. Got three more matches until the tag team championship. Let's see if we can do it. Come to think of it, I think uh, WrestleFest was actually one of the only wrestling games that was ever in arcade. Like, official arcades. Everything else was arcade style um, when they did that.
Oh, we're back in the ring. That's a new boy now. Oh. That's crazy. That's two matches down. Now go for the next match. Two down, two to go. Oh, they put me in the cage off. Oh, right to the corner. Oh, Jake got me. What the hell is going on here? That gets confusing because when you're pinning your guy, you get control of your your partner. There's another one down. Now go for the next match. Mm. In a bad way. I gotta get the Hawkster in. As Dredd likes to say quite often, oof. <laughs> Ooh, back body drop to slaughter.
Oof. These motherfuckers are fighting. Let's get Warrior back in here. Title match coming up next. Oh, that was horse shit. Bastards ain't giving us any kind of a inch. Oh! 
bitch. Next match. Well, there you have it, guys. That is the end of the wrestling fest or wrestle fest videos. Uh, next Time Warp video is going to be on WWE WrestleMania Arcade. May even still be considered WWF. Uh, that one will be brought to us on the Saturn emulator. And as always, I want to go ahead and ask you all to hit that like and subscribe button. Smash that notification bell so you don't miss out on more of our new Time Warp segment. As well as other kick-ass content from me, Dread Crowley, and Gamers Purgatory. Make sure you check out the description below for a link to our Discord. And guys, as always, I will see you in our next video.